We're learning more about yesterday's weather related helicopter crash in Taunton. A wind gust brought this chopper crashing on its side as it was trying to take off. And tonight we're hearing from the pilot. Eyewitness News reporter Erica Ritchie joins us now from the control room with his story. Well, it's not a story he ever expected to tell as he says he never anticipated the circumstance he found himself in yesterday, one that turned his helicopter into something like an amusement park ride. It just uh, rolled us over. A rollover in mid-air, but video from Taunton Municipal Airport proves this ride didn't come to an end like those at a thrill park. In fact, the helicopter had barely taken off, only a foot off the ground when it came crashing down around noon yesterday. The pilot, Richard Dote, takes us to that moment as he shares his story by phone. It was just uh, lifting off, and I guess I caught a gust and uh, I didn't react quick enough. Winds were gusting at 22 miles per hour at the time of the crash, according to the National Weather Service. Our meteorologists say that's typically not considered strong enough to flip a chopper unless it catches it just right. That's partly why Dote wasn't expecting it. You're always trying to be prepared, but it, it just caught me, uh, caught me quickly and um, as I said, I didn't have quite enough time to respond. Both he and his passenger walked out of the helicopter after it crashed. Thankfully, they have no bumps or bruises to document the ordeal. Only this video and a memory that will undoubtedly produce an intriguing story for years to come. And the crash didn't interrupt any flight schedules at the Taunton Municipal Airport, and a minor fuel leak was quickly cleaned. The FAA is now spearheading this investigation. In the control room, I'm Erica Ritchie, Eyewitness News.